Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Anthony and I'm the Art Grower. So in this video guys, I'm going to talk about my 2024 Mulberry pruning technique. So, no more intros, let's get right into it. So guys, these are my Mulberry trees. As you can see, depolated them yesterday to induce dormancy like period so we don't have dormancy total dormancy in the tropical country so this is to trick the tree that they're undergoing a dormancy period so the idea in this guys this is another way of maximizing the protein capacity of your mulberry trees if you're growing them in buckets like this one so because of limited soil they open produce a lot of twigs like this that will eventually turn into mature twigs they'll turn into brown ones so the idea in this guys when these buds on the tip will produce flowers and eventually will become fruits in the future this will naturally bend this twig going down like this and then forcing these buds to bud break as well creating a lot of flowers and fruits at this long twig not like when you prune the trees like this one this has a lot of fruiting buds around it but when this one bud breaks the flowers will be concentrated on this part and they will become fruits as well but only on this part then they will grow a foliage to support the fruits so this is another way of getting a lot of fruits on container grown mulberry trees I'll show you how big this grower this mulberry so as you can see guys, in just 3 months, look at the growth that has been produced in just 3 months. So I'll demonstrate to you how I prune these trees later on in this video. So guys, in this demonstration, we're going to need a hansel and a pruner. guys after you eliminated those big branches so we have to defoliate this one and 
and we have to prune the roots the top roots that has been grown and into the ground so every once a year I do this so I won't lose the root ball on the buckets Guys, I like to use a concave chisel and removing those big roots. One more. So I'm just going to clean the bottom part. Yes. So uh, every year I do this this uh, removal of pig roots at the top into the ground so I won't lose the root ball inside of this but eventually I'm going to prune the root ball in this in some time but not today. So guys, I'm just going to finish the defoliation on this tree and maybe remove some of the dead branches.
So guys, that's it. That's how I prune my mulberry trees to maximize the pruning capacity of each and every trees. So guys, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please subscribe to my channel. And thank you for watching The Yard Grower. Till next time, guys.